Hello and welcome back audience to my FIFA 15 Cardiff City career mode and welcome back guys and I want to say a huge big thank you to everyone who's been dropping likes and comments on the recent videos. It's been absolutely awesome as I always say I love talking to you guys and if you are new around here guys don't forget I keep saying this don't forget to subscribe and never be scared to drop a comment down below and I've seen a load of new people that have been subscribed to the channel for a long time but they're only just starting to comment. Don't ever be afraid to comment guys you know we're all fl friendly around here. We together built this channel and it's a nice, friendly place. Drop a comment, let me know how your day's going, whether you're having a hard day at school, whether you're having a good day at work, good day at school, if, you, if you're struggling with exams or anything like that. Just drop a comment and we'll get a conversation going. And if you ever need me, guys, if you ever need to talk to me, make sure you can check my Twitter. I'll leave a link in the description below. Hit me up on Snapchat. That's just Brothers, exactly how it's spelled on the screen, exactly how my channel is. Just Brothers, B-R-A-D-3 double R-Z. You can also hit me up on Instagram, that's exactly the same, brad 3 rz And if you ever want to hit me up on them and you just want to tell me how your day's going or tell me if you've got a bit of a struggle, because I know a lot of people are coming out recently saying, listen Brad, some days I really have a hard day and have a tough day at work or school or I'm having a tough day with the family and watching your videos really helps me and just helps me relax and chill out and I enjoy watching it and that is the best thing anyone could ever say to me guys so if you have ever got a problem and you think I can be there and I might be able to help you out just make sure you comment don't don't ever let it build up inside if you can talk to someone about it and I could possibly be that person make sure you come and talk to me I don't bite guys but nevertheless if you do enjoy this episode make sure to smash that thumbs up for me guys as I said drop a comment down below if you're new around there click that subscribe button and I've started today guys on the email because about an hour ago I finished the match, Stoke, and unfortunately we did lose 1-0, so we uploaded it, and I come back, and this is the email that we had, I advanced in time all the way to the Manchester City game, and the board had a bit of a harsh comment towards us, the fans are moaning, saying, brothers, what are you doing with the team, and this is the email that I've received, so it says, brothers... We want to mention our satisfaction with the quality of football we are seeing from the lads. We understand you are under a lot of media pressure and we want to assure you that you are considered or you are considered an invalu invaluable member of the Cardiff City family. Sorry about that guys, I couldn't get that word out then. Sincerely, Chairman of the Board of Directors. Now, that's absolutely fabulous in my eyes because... Although the board are having a bit of a moan and saying, listen, what are you doing? The lads, they're not playing to their full potential. The fact they send me that and say, you're a member of the Cardiff City family, that makes me feel warm and welcome. And that's exactly what I need from this club because I have literally just thrived on success. I've wanted the most out of every game. I wanted the most out of all the players. Harry Kane, when he played bad, we dropped him. We left him dropped. If players aren't playing to their potential that I think, I just dropped them. Simple as that. Teddy, he's another one we brought him in. He started well, started playing poor, dropped him, brought him back in, he got injured, dropped him. It's just one of those things, this is what you've got to do as a manager. If a player's not playing well, you either battle through it and just hope that he gets his, his potential back, he gets his confidence. If he's a striker, he starts scoring goals. He builds that confidence and that happiness inside him and he stays positive and he keeps pushing. But sometimes players just can't and that means you have to drop them to the bench, let them keep training, watch them every week, day in, day out in training and just see if they are proceeding forwards or whether they're staying as their maybe not negative but their shy side where they're just not doing what they should be doing but nevertheless guys we are against Manchester City today and as we all know it is not going to be an easy game whatsoever we played them last time they've got Benzema running right they've got Silva they've got so many good players companies and other one so many good players running right and they literally did last time we played them although it was in the FA Cup and the first leg come we lost 3-0. Second leg, we managed to get two goals back. We just couldn't get that third goal. That's all we needed, just one more. And we come close right at the end, but we just couldn't put it in the net. So they did knock us out of the FA Cup. So maybe the team will be looking for a bit of revenge. And this is the squad I've gone for today. I've gone for a 4-4-2 Holden. Now, the reason for this is because I feel... I watched the video about 10 minutes ago when we played City. And I just felt... They were a bit too attack and they had too much space. So I've gone for 4-4-2 to try and break that up. So we've got Cole and Tellyman's up front. Now, yes, I've brought Cole in. He is an ex-Manchester City player. So I thought he might just have the potential today to want to go and score goals and do well for his team. Tellyman's played pretty well last time and I'm not going to drop him because he's our highest rater. Or highest rated player, sorry. We've got Noon at right mid. Ikram's come back into the team after injury. He got injured. 
We played him. He got injured in that game, and now he's come back, so I'm playing him again. Hopefully he won't get injured today. Hughes in left defensive midfield, Delhi at left mid, Flanagan at left back, Rekic at left centre back, Sewell at right centre back, Theo Phil's made his way into the team at right back just because Fabio is a little bit tired, he's not got full energy, so I thought I'd drop him, bring Theo Phil in, and we've obviously got Magic Marshall in goal. But nevertheless, guys, let's get into today's game. I'm so hoping that maybe we can get a draw out of this. I'll be happy with a draw against City because after last time we played them, we didn't half struggle. But let's just see what the outcome of today's game is. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Premier League. Today it's it's raining. City We're at the Etihad Stadium in Manchester Let's and it's raining. Why can't we just have a bit of sun? This is why if we go to a team in Spain, it'll be warm every day. It'll be nice and sunny. So may may maybe Spain's where we're meant to be because I love the sun so much maybe. I mean, although I've just come back off holiday a couple of weeks ago and I was in snow and rain there. I mean... I know this is different. This is FIFA. I don't. I like cold weather in real life. To be perfectly honest with you, but when it comes to FIFA and the ball slides a lot more, I would rather it just be sunny. Go Cole. Let's go. Come on, Tellymans. Oh, there we go. We got a corner. This is a good start. This lads. Come on, good ball in. Sul. For nope. the next couple of hours or so, he's got to forget friendships and try and outwit his former Come on, team. Cole, you've got to do better than that. See, Cole's one that always, see oh, that was fancy. always seems nervous on the ball Jean for some Martino. reason. He's like Liverpool's Mamadou Sacco, the defender. He just looks Matthew. nervous on the ball, and although he's a good player, sometimes you just think, how did that even get there? Or how did he put that ball Jean through Martino. to that player? Because... He just never looks confident. No. And there you go. 1 0. Benzema after 12 minutes. The first attempt on goal and they've scored. Oh, this is why. This is why I won the go to Manchester City. They absolutely dominate. They really do. Oh, referee! He's nearly injured Ephraim. That would have been. I'd have screamed. If he'd have injured Ephraim then, I would have went mental. Come on, go Cole, go Cole, finish that, finish it, come on, oh, I don't believe it, I actually do not believe it, we had a chance then, we actually decided, come on Theophil, make that run, that's nice, and again Theophil, keep that run going, that'll do, keep him under pressure, what I like to see. See, Theophil is going to be a contender for the right back position, so when we play a player like that, I think he's going to come out and he's going to try his hard just because if he plays well, he'll get in the te team. Simple as that. Oh, look at this. Don't say that. Oh, Tellymans, that's going to be a first time pass to Cole. Should have been first time. Winning team in England's Come on, Cole, chase him. Ever. Oh, nearly. His contribution. We're doing. We're still doing pretty well on the attack the side here, to be honest. We're not. Uh, we're not holding back. We're still going for it here. Oh, come on, ref, jog on. What an absolute joke. Benzema playing well. He's playing absolutely tremendous. He's scoring for fun against anyone, not just us. No. Oh, well done. Well done. I don't know why I'm saying well done. I really don't. Just happy it didn't go in. Go on, get up there. Well done. Nice. Come on, Cole. Looking at Manuel Pellegrini, first season in England, he wins two trophies. Go, 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 go. Go on, Moon. Keep it in. Oh. See, this is why I hate the rain. If that wasn't raining, then we could have had that. No problem. You put them down as... Well, one of the front runners this season again and for a few seasons to come as well. Oh, come on, Torre's injured there. Now from he's not moving like he normally does, is he? That's because he went over I, I don't ankle. care if he's not he moving how he normally is. I honestly don't care. Okay. Thanks, Jeff. That's I'm happy. Because it might just give us that little bit of a... 
confidence to just go for Oh, come on, lads. What are you doing, Telemans? They've got a player injured, which basically means at the moment we're being Torre. Right. They've basically got ten men here. Oh, come on. Gian Martino is another one they've got. Absolutely tremendous player. Oh, ref. Good save, Marshall. Come on, Telly Mind, you've got round them. Go on. Oh, it's been saved. What is going on? Give us this goal. Come on, Telly Mind. Good ball. Look for Sewell. Look for Ikram. Look for. Co oh, Cole. You just take too much time. You've got all the time in the world, Cole, haven't you? But really, you haven't. You should have just hit that. Boy, Atta. I wonder why they're playing him. He's only a youngster. And he's good as well. He just never gets in the team. But really, he probably should get ahead of Mangala because he's pretty terrible. Oh, no. Benzema's got through. Well done. Oh, look at that. Chase it. Go on, go out for a corner. Oh no, it's going to stop. I love the way it stops for them when it's raining. But if that was us, that would have just flew out. I'd have been in row Ed. Half time, guys, and 1 0. But you know what? I'm not shocked. I'm actually not. You know, we're, we're playing Manchester City. They're one of the biggest clubs in the BPL. They've got some of the best players. And even in real life, they've got amazing players. On this, they've brought Benzema and Cavani in. I mean. It just goes to show. Collar off for Sagna. Seems a bit of a mad movement. Unless he's tired or he's injured or something. Yes, good tackle. Cole, I need you to run. Prep be a bit quicker than that. See, I've got no options now, lads. You've you've all got Premier League marked. Ref. Ref. Well, that is a joke, isn't it? That is an absolute joke. I can't believe that it's just happened. We just got crippled, and they got nothing for it. Come on, lads. Go on, Cole. Go on, Tellymans, keep going. Come on, Cole, get up. Oh, so close. Tries to just chip it in. Get on, Benzema. Don't let him through. Or Cavani. Oh, we've nearly let them through there, lads. No. Don't let him get that ball in. Don't let him cut back. No. Well done. That'll do. Oh, I thought that was dropping to Cole. Gian Martino. Gian Martino. I am so concentrated here, lads. I'm feeling that they're playing a little bit. They're just not playing how they normally would. Good save. Now someone's pulled a muscle. Go Cole. Go Cole. Go! No! Oh. Caballero, why didn't you just stay in your goal for me? Didn't you stay in the net? Navas is injured. We're going to have to make some changes in a minute. We're going to have to do something. Passed it, gets it back, passes it again, wants it back. Now Hughes. What about Cardiff City in their next game, Alan? Well, they're playing Norwich City, aren't they, in their next match in the box? Go tell him, Hans. Don't see them having too many problems. Come on, oh, keep it in. Well, this is the time where the managers. And they've got Oscar from Chelsea. That's unbelievable. So wish I'd have got to Manchester City now. 
Can't believe he ain't done me like that. Oscar. They're just bringing fresh legs Keeping on now, which could be a worry. Go, go, Cole. Go, Cole, come on. Come on, Cole. No! Cole, why can't you finish? You are, oh, what are you doing to me? Come on, Tallyman's good ball. Sewell. No. Oh, Akram. This isn't good. Come on, lads, we're going to have to make a change here. 76th minute. How's the team looking? Tired. Expected that, really. Right, let's go here. Uh, bring Delhi into the middle. Hughes off for Lingard. Bring Ibon. Take Cole off. Who are we bringing on? Martial. Fondre. Martial. Fondre. Martial. Come on, Martial. Come on. That's no problem to the goalkeeper. It's straight at him. Easy. Substitute is ready for Man City. Magnus Acre. Go on, make that run. Yes, Hughes. Good ball in. Oh, what are you doing, Cole? Why take so many touches? The Please pass it. Counting down towards the end of the 90 minutes. Nine minutes left. Nine minutes left, and the ball hasn't gone. We haven't even got the new in. players on yet. The time almost up. Just, How just. This, uh, impacting on the next game. Well, Manchester City go up Come on. Stoke after this, Martin. They've been below oh, it's, no, it's not good. Out here. They need to improve. Well, they need their supporters in this situation, I think. They're holding their lead, and the fans are doing their best to encourage them. They are, but I think they're a bit nervous because they've sat off a bit, inviting pressure. Oh, so close, Cole. Keeps it going well. No! I should just put it out. I should have now. The game has been dictated by Manchester City, and the reward for that should be victory. They've licked up well. This could be a chance. No! Chance. Just, oh. I just want to put it out. To get these fresh legs on. So I'm not even gonna have time. I'm actually not even gonna have time to get them on now. Oh, I am. It's not like that's gonna make much of a difference. We're at the 90th minute now. I don't care. I just wanted to get the players on. <sighs> All out attack. Let's go. What? Oh, you've just robbed me here again. You've actually just mugged me off. It was literally 89th minute. What was the add-on time? One minute. Uh, it does me add in. Such a silly goal as well. Such a silly, silly goal. I know we did well out there, but it's not good enough. The board are going to be screaming at me now. The Barclays Premier League. Manchester City. All right, what we'll do is Cardiff City, we'll skip a little bit of time. Manchester United. We'll simulate a little bit of time, and then we'll go over to the office. Three. We'll have a read of our punishments. West Ham United one, Liverpool nil. And let's take a look. Okay, we haven't got a punishment. I'll do me. The table remain Chelsea with 77 points. Yeah, I'm sure you are, Cole. You know, you're over the moon and that, but you're not doing anything for me. You're just missing goal. You're not scoring. It's just not good enough. But nevertheless, guys, that's all I've got time for. If you have enjoyed this episode, make sure to smash that thumbs up for me. Make sure to drop a comment down below. If this is the first video you're ever watching of mine, click that subscribe button and come and join this hell of a roller coaster. Whether we're up high scoring five goals or we're down low getting beat by Manchester City. Doesn't matter in my eyes as long as I enjoy playing the game, which I do. As long as you guys enjoy watching, which I'm sure most of you do. That's all that matters to me. It has been your boy, brothers. Peace out.